number seven, Andy Martin. You've been following a bit close. Yeah, unfortunately, in that stage, we uh, caught up to the card in front of us and uh, one of our Aussie brothers, and uh, he couldn't see us behind him clearly, uh, wouldn't pull over. So um, when he dropped the clutch, it smashed the windscreen, and uh, he pulled over about 100 metres up the road, and we kept going without a windscreen, so it's pretty unfortunate. So you got the crew working furiously there. You'll be right to get out to stage five? Yeah, we've got a spare window there, so um, other than this, the car's going really well, and uh, we're enjoying the road so far. But it's not only about the Otago Classic, but you're actually an entrant in the New Zealand Championship as well. Yeah, that's right, Mark. Yeah, no, we uh, we doing the whole series this year for our second year. Um, we've done a few things to the car off season, and uh, we're a bit slow up in Ray, had a few problems, but uh, we've got it going really well now, so we're looking forward to a, a good weekend. So this is an RX3, obviously. Anything special about it? Uh, not really. We've uh, we've borrowed a, a diff from uh, from the Ford boys. It's got an Atlas diff this year, which is uh, a lot better than it was, um, and some good bits in it. And uh, Pierre Ford Automotive and Tauranga and Dean Buist at Palmside look after the car and do a great job. So it's all good. Looks like your crew's doing a great job there as they get you ready to get back out into the stages.